It's good to see you. You and the Red Templar's leader seem to have personal history. When I arrived in Kirkwall, Samson and I shared quarters. He seemed a decent man at first. Knight Commander Meredith later expelled Samson for erratic behavior. He ended up begging on Kirkwall streets. He committed further crimes, but managed to evade the Order's justice. Now Samson serves Corypheus as his loyal general. Why do you think Samson joined Corypheus? He had a chronic lyrium addiction. He spent every last coin buying it from local smugglers. Perhaps Corypheus flattered his vanity, gave him purpose as well as lyrium. Perhaps that's all it took. It sounds like Samson had a miserable life. The Order expelled him, but he had choices. He could have found another path. I don't understand how he became so powerful. Even with Red Lyrium, Samson's glory days are long behind him. Was there something you needed? Is there anything I should know? Repairs to Skyhold's fortifications are progressing. Our scouts report no immediate threats in the surrounding area. We are fortunate Solus knew of this place. Do you have some time? For you, always. The day you kissed me on the battlements, how long had you wanted to do that? <laughs> Longer than I should admit. The time Dalish never bothered you. I hadn't considered. Elves weren't treated differently in the circles I served. I didn't think what it might mean to you. I hope that doesn't... I mean, does it bother you? I don't know. Maybe. If you're not serious. I am. If I seem unsure, it's because it's been a long time since I've wanted anyone in my life. I wasn't expecting to find that here. Or you. The Commander of the Inquisition and the Herald of Andraste. That will have people talking. Oh, you wouldn't believe how quickly gossip spreads through the barracks. Does it bother you? I would rather my... our private affairs remain that way. But if there were nothing here for people to talk about, I would regret it more. Think you could slip away? I believe so. Wait for me.